Back again on air. Hii ni Havana News. Mimi natumai siku yako imekuwa poa kabisa popote pale unanisikiliza. Inabidi twende mpaka Njambini kule Nyandarua County. Wale wa Mlima Kenya wanaijua sana hii location. Na uso bwana, hasa huku ndo panapatikana nyumbani kwa marehem Dedan Kimathi miongoni mwa watu ambao walipigania sana nchi yetu hii hapa kupata uhuru lakini wiki jana taarifa mbovu ilikuwa ni kwamba tulipoteza mke wake ambaye anajulikana kama Mukami sasa Mukami bwana anatarajiwa kuzikwa hivi karibuni na kama kawaida serikali ndio inachukua jukumu kuanzia moja mpaka mia moja kwa kisha kwamba mama marehemu Mukami anapata sindikizo fani vizuri sana sasa ishu hata si eti kwamba serikali imejitokeza sijui na kufanya o, kufanya hii kufanya ile a a ishu ni kwamba kwa nini serikali sasa hivi ndio imejitokeza kuonyesha uzuri wake wakati mama amesha fariki wakati tunafahamu vizuri kabisa ni miongoni mwa watu ambao walivumilia kweli kweli mazingira magumu ili nchi yetu sasa hivi enjoy vitu ambavyo tuna enjoy innovations happening at Mukami Kimathi home ahead of her burial sasa bwana unajua tena walimwengu wa wakosi kuongea walimwengu ikawa anasema sasa hivi vitu ambavyo mnavifanya sasa hivi ningevifanya kipindi ambacho mama Mukami alikuwa anapumua kwa nini sasa hivi ndo jifanya watu wazuri sana nyie serikali sasa watu wanalaumu sana wile msamuel ruto kujitokeza ma, uh, sio mapema <laughs> anamlaumu sana wile msamuel ruto kujitokeza uh, bwana late kabisa wakati vitu vimesha haribika kwa mfano nitakupa tu comments uh, watu wawili watatu hapa benji anasema when she was alive she lived very poor life now she's dead and people want to pretend how they cared a cops important that than a life being preparation for long political mileage speech afun doma ye kana sema of what benefit if they could not enjoy those benefits when alive in this world when you die even your enemies contribute more for good coffin alafu dixon hapo china sema we have thousands of freedom fighters who are still languishing in poverty but the government is still waiting for them to die before it can acknowledge their existence of uh, pure chana sema acha nisiongee vibaya but wait would she have been more happy if these renovations were done while she was alive alafu mwisho kabisa karl patrick anasema welcome to kenya where the state recognizes you only when you are horizontal sasa unaona watu bwana wanalalamikia kweli kweli serikali hii hapa kwa kushughulika uh, wakati bwana mtu amesha fariki i think kwangu mimi serikali wanatakiwa kuwa na mbinu fulani hivi au hata uh, naweza kusema method fulani hivi ya kuwashughulikia wale watu ambao wana mchango kwa taifa wakati bado wako hai si tu kwamba wakifariki ndio mnakuja kujitokeza hapa eti hey, tutasaidia sio nini a a yashagwa na tabia hiyo by the way kusema oh sio alikuwa mtu mzuri a a tunataka kuona uzuri wake wakati bado anapumua bwana au sio bwana niambie maoni yako hapo chini kwenye sehemu ya comments na kikubwa zaidi subscribe ili uendelee kupata taarifa nyingi na mpya kila wakati bye bye